<laughs> Hello everyone and welcome to my channel Micah Let's Play and guess who I am? I'm Micah! Because who else would I be? Certainly not Marceline. We are getting ready to play some more Baldur's Gate 3. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I hope you guys are excited for this new section of the game. We are getting ready to go into the Underdark, but before we get started properly, just look at our crew. So what I did, just so everyone is aware, is that I went ahead and put Astarian back in the other armor I had him in before I put him in Mathara's armor, because honestly, this armor to me looks better without the giant shoulder pads, and they're at the exact same armor class, they're both 14, so why not put him in what looks better? And for Gale, I put him in uh, that same red outfit, but because I didn't like the way the red and the gold look together, I switched it to pink. Um, I made his hat pink. I did a little, a few things to make him look a little better. And then for the incredible and beautiful Shadowheart, um, what I did for her is that um, it's the same armor she was in before, but I went ahead and made it the light blue. And I think it came out looking really nice on her. So yes, fashion show documentary is over. <laughs> And so, what we need to do, guys, is that I did remember in the other episode, I had said I forgot some things, but I did forget even more than I originally realized. I was going over some footage, and I realized I need to go back to the Emerald Grove, and it is for a good reason, and then we're gonna go back to the Underdark, um, and right back here where it says Underdark Beach, so apparently they're, oh no, I'm not gonna go to the beach. I'm just gonna go to the Saluna outpost. Salunite outpost. So let's go to the Emerald Grove right now because I realized some things I was forgetting. Okay, so let's go this way, guys. Um, what I realized I forgot was actually like two different things. Well, actually three, it's actually three different things. The first thing is actually right here. Remember in the very, when you first come to the grove and you're looking for a shovel? Well, if you do this, you'll get a shovel. And you'll also get this box right here. So a starring, if you would be so kind. And look at that, made some money, you know, got a shovel. So if you ever are looking for a shovel when you first come to this area, that is where you can find one. The other area is over here when um, when we first met, uh, Raphael, this was an area I had came to, but I didn't explore it all the way because I got distracted because I think Lazelle wasn't with our party or something. And I think, yeah, I got everything that was over here. I don't think there's anything else. Ah, see, yeah, there are two things that I missed. One, this mushroom, you know, so again, you know, I'm a weirdo completionist. I like to find everything um, that is meant to be collected because off camera, I do I do use the alchemy feature quite a bit. So, okay. So first things first, um, I do believe that chest is empty, but I never went here. So I never checked this. So this barrel is empty, so that's fine. I believe, yeah, this barrel is empty. I didn't go to this barrel because I didn't even know it was here. And look, a potion, a healing potion, and then a potion here. So of glorious valor or something like that, virtuous something. So now this cop, this these bones right here, I didn't get. But what I discovered is that there's something very important when you get these bones. So let's see. There is a silver pendant here. I wonder what it does. Necklace has a harper sigil. Why were they here? So, if you go into your menu, hold on, if you go into your menu and you go to this necklace, look at what it does. It's a cantrip that gives you guidance. So if you are a character and, or like say you don't have Shadowheart uh, in your party or if you never gave your character guidance when you initially created them, this pendant will allow you to do it. Now, right now, I think, yeah, this necklace right now for Gale gives him lightning charges. So this is a class. And I think the only time you get lightning charges 
is when you start like doing magic or whatever. But I noticed the necklace never worked. So if I'm misunderstanding this or something, someone tell me in the comment section. So what I'm going to do with Gail is that I'm going to give him this pendant of guidance. Because I think, yeah, this is Misty Step. Astarian's wearing this. Um, Shadowheart's wearing this. I'm wearing this thing. This thing here is Opportunity Attack which I think is really good for someone like a Starian. But what I'm gonna do, um, because Gale has Misty Step, I'm gonna go ahead and give him this pendant. So now I have three player, three characters that actually have guidance. Keep your distance, so, darling. as you can see, um, everybody- late, always shock. Yeah, so I think everybody should be good based on how I uh, set up each character. Hopefully that makes sense. So yeah, so Let's if you move. come back to this area, um, you'll see that it is uh, something that's there. So hold on, let me go to Gale. Which way to the nearest library. Yeah. So yeah, Gale has Missy Step, so cool beats. So now, no what I need to do, believe this. what I'm gonna do to kind of speed things along since I'm talking so much, um, I'm gonna go back to the ruins that are just outside where we found Withers because I missed some stuff in here too. Again, I discovered it later. One, come on guys, I think I got, yeah, I got all the plants that were out here, but what I realized is that when you go in this area, there is stuff in here that I didn't get on my first when I first came in here, again, because I was still so new to the game and there was a lot that I just didn't notice. Uh, but um, I was watching, like I said, watching replays of everything and I was realizing this jug right here, this little jug, I didn't pick this up. That's number one. Number two, I think, yeah, I got this guy. Um, yeah, I got everything over here, I believe. I'm just turning these on because everything must be lit. Um, okay, I got everything over here, I think. Yes, yes. Okay, cool beans. I'm, I'm just trying to double check because I miss so much stuff. I miss so much. Okay, I looted this guy. I looted this guy. And then um, over here, um, again, I think I got this chest. Yes, I got this chest. And I think I got everything in there with withers, but I want to double check. Oh, what's this? Oh, I didn't know there was a candle here. Ooh, I'm gonna I'm turn all these on one. <laughs> I know some of you might be laughing or saying, Micah, are you fucking serious? Absolutely. Just like the absolute is serious about dominating the world. I am absolutely serious about coming in here. Yeah, I checked this. I think, did I check this? I think I didn't check all these vases. So I don't know if I left something behind in here uh, because I don't think I ever looked inside um, this like I was meaning to. Um, Clementis, you're not gonna, okay. So I don't think you do that and see this. And this little jug here. I didn't pick that up. Like, oh my glob. And oh, the reason why I'm doing this is because this is technically, this is money. Like, this is money we could be benefiting from. Apparently, I guess you can't open that particular one. And I think I opened this. Yeah, I got everything in here. Now, when we leave here, guys, um, and we come back up this way. Yeah, because we looted him. And did we loot this guy too? Yeah, we looted him also. Now, in here, when we come back in here, this I did not um, loot. Um, I got this, but I didn't open this. And there's a soul coin in it. So I was like, oh, wow, I didn't get that soul coin. And then, yeah, I checked that. And then also, for anyone who may have not known this, if you just do this, you can light that up. Okay, so I believe, oh, and this, 
this um, vase right here, you can also get this vase. Clementis, there we go. You can pick up this vase as well. This is all money. Um, so in here, now this area is completely, I believe, completely picked clean. And just because I did it before, why the hell not? Like, this is how you know I have like massive OCD because no one would really be wanting to do this. But I do, because everything must be lit. It makes everything beautiful. And it's just fun to do it. Okay, so I believe, oh, and then there's one down here too. Um, so I believe in this particular area, you, I, I got everything I was supposed to get in this area. Yeah. Ah. So you get everything you need to get in this area. Cool beans, that's everything. I don't think there's anything else to find in this area. Um, oh yeah, and then this is another thing, guys. In case some of you may have never come back here again after your initial thing, and this is also another thing I forgot. Once, you can't go that way, it's like you're blocked, but this, this handle right here, I don't know why I'm trying to jump, but this handle right here, if you use it, remember when I couldn't lockpick that thing? This is why it was so difficult, because you just come down here, you pull the ladder down, and boom, you're right here. And if you go to the skeleton, I realized I was missing all this stuff. I was like, what? How could I be missing all of this? How am, how am I so blind? But yeah, that's what actually happened. I think I got everything over here. Yeah, that's the only thing over here these things over here i needed to get outside of um outside of you know the area with the harper and here i think that's everything if i realize i forgot something else then i forgot something else um and also the shovel out here um uh, because again i'm very serious about getting as much treasure as possible um and making all the money we can so with that said um i'm going to go back to the grove which i'm basically in the area uh i'm gonna go back to the grove and i'm gonna sell the few things that i have instead of going to volo because i realize volo is limited on how much money and items he has so with that said I will be back. Really? Who knows how long it'll take these folks to get their own foot? If they make it. They're slow, vulnerable. Half of more will die long before that's an escape. Doesn't seem to trouble you a jot. What good would it do for me to be troubled? We can't save them all. Okay, guys, I'm back. Now, what I forgot to do was talk to this guy right here, which was Dorn. And he is, look, I can do speak of the speak with the dead. And apparently I can't do it with that. But I think I might have a scroll. If I don't have a scroll. No rest for the wicked, I see. Yeah, then I think Gail has it. Right? Hold on, let's let's check. Because I think I gave, yeah, I gave this to Gail. No, that's me. It's Gail. Yeah, this right here. This is what I gave Gail. And I think, yeah, Speak with the Dead is one of them, so. So we are gonna talk to this dude right here. And no lie. Gail looks so fucking sexy. The like, corpse regards you lifelessly. We're gonna ask our questions, but again, something about Gail with the way his beard look, his glowing eyes, and that hat is just like, that's a good look on him. He, I think I would love to play a character that's a necromancer with a similar look. Not the same look, but a similar look. I think would be very sexy. Okay. So even though we know how he was petrified, we're still gonna ask the dumbest fuck question. So Gail would be, how were you petrified? Sarkrim, argument, summoned spectator. Ah. So like the other guy said, Zongrim summoned a spectator. 
So, who are you? Dawn! House Bartol! Graven Hollow Scholar! Mm. Cool beans. So, do you carry any valuables? But we already know it was the the, the memory the memory shard. Um, okay. So you look like okay. You were looking for a forge. Can you tell me more about it? Okay. So first, we're gonna ask because I think I asked two questions already. So we're gonna ask why did you argue with Zagreb? He wanted. Memory shot. Okay. So now you were looking for a forge. Where uh, I said, what can you tell me about it? Because I think that's what Clementus had yesterday. Well, not yes. Well, yesterday <laughs> for you, whenever you watch this, because I'm recording like back to back to back when I have time. So, um, uh, yeah. So, you were looking for a forge. Tell me, uh, tell me more about it. Adamantium. Precious beyond measure. Aha. Okay. So, well, we already know how we use the memory shard. You have to use magic. What does this memory shard do? Where are you from? So, what we're going to ask is, what does it do? And I think it just holds memory. Because, like I said, I think... You know what? We already know what, what, how to use it, and we already know what it does. So let's see if he's carrying anything valuable. It'll probably be the memory shard. Memory shard. Gotcha. The spell's power wanes. You can ask no more questions. Interesting. So when I fought the specter the other day, I have a lot on my mind, and well, in it. Well, Dorn, the other guy that was here, Marthas, or Martha, he's gone already. He left. But what I what I noticed is that he said um, this guy, you know, was the guy. I guess he was the guy in charge. So the question is, is Zagrim one of these corpses? You know what I mean? Because this is Mayo. Uh, yeah. No, these are. I don't think these are. Yeah, no, these are not the same people. So I'm wondering, let's just say one of the other ones had lived, would we been able to talk with them like we were able to do with him? You know what I mean? So I would just curious on how that would work. And then also I realized something. These gems here, all of this stuff is for potion brewing. So I'm like, oh my glob, I was not picking any of this stuff up. Now, if you want to avoid um, going over there with those poison toxins, you can literally just jump over here, and I don't know why. Oh, yes. I did not know this. Come on, Gail. I literally was just jumping over here to to avoid the poison. Yes, darling. Oh, I'm so sorry. Um, I was trying to open this. <gasps> oh, yes, and we will take off. Now, I think this allows us to just jump over here. This is to avoid all those toxins. So yeah, so basically I'll be right back to where I was. Come on, Astarian. Okay, cool bean. So what we're gonna do really quickly is once again, I'm gonna quick save. So I know how I'm gonna proceed and go forward. Oh, we gotta go this way. Um, how I wish to proceed and go forward is um i'm gonna go the i'm gonna go down first and then after i go down um how like this is how i'm gonna do this i'm gonna go this way first then i'm gonna go the way where we found this drow where we talked to him the one that died down here so i'm gonna talk i'm gonna use this and go up but i think i'm gonna need to change my party because i need to get to like characters that can really jump so that'll be like Carlac and Lazel. Um, because I don't think Clementis can jump that high. So yeah, so we're gonna go this way first. Uh, because apparently there are different ways you can go. And then after I do the jumping mushrooms thing, um, then I'm going to oh then I'm gonna go inside the castle 
And then the last thing I'm gonna do, wait, pick up? We could pick something up. Oh, a shell. Another shell. But I also saw a skeleton. Okay, we're not gonna do that. We're gonna pick up these shells. A bunch of shells. I did not realize this. I see this only as one thing, money. So we're gonna do that. Pick up all these little fishies and all these rotten mushrooms. It says I can't reach, can't reach. Skeleton, ooh. Helmet of uh, al uh, autonomy, sorry. I wonder what this helmet does. Hold on guys. What is this? Proficient with wisdom saving throws. Ooh. And this is light armor. I right now I I, I want to keep my items the way they are right now. And you know how I was now I've been saying like, oh how was a how was a starian always getting the initiative roll? It's the helmet he has on. It actually gives him higher uh, roles uh, when it comes to initiative and stuff. So I was like, oh, hold on. What the fuck is over here? I'm so confused. I, I just started talking. Um, pick up. For some reason, I'm stuck. Directly. Yeah. Let's see if we can get everybody to move. The mantis is still stuck. All's well that ends. Well, not as bad as it could have. Right? How weird. Use? Oh, okay. That was weird. Okay. So what else is over here? And I don't want to become over encumbered too quickly. But it looks like it's going that way. Okay, look. Look at the little people. Wild chanting? Okay. I don't know what they are. It just seems like they're in worship. I hope, I hope, let's quick save real quick. I hope this is not gonna be a problem, you know, with the, with the group I have. Okay. It looks like they're all in worship. Okay. So we're just gonna climb down. Oh, it looks like there's more than one way to get down. Oh, that's so cool. They all go down on uh, different things. Gail, why did you climb back up? Okay. What on earth? Okay. Let's see what happens. Let's. Can we talk to them? Okay. Let's talk to them. Creature is lost in devotion. He might as well not exist. Oh. Okay. How oh. blood to fill your oceans, oh blessed Pu'al. Uh -huh. A bones to build your temple in the deep. A wave of pure devotion washes over you, and with every surge, you feel a presence grow in response. Bird priest, promises your god wants proof once. Blood. These beings are Kuatoa, former Mind Flayer slaves that manifest their gods through sheer belief. Aha. Uh -huh. You, our Lord of Murder demands sacrifice. You will be an offering for the great god Boal. Bitch. No, I'm not. No, I no. And that looks like that's a red cap. Okay. You can give it a rest. Your god isn't real. Buhal, Baal, is the god of murder. You know what the funny thing is? He was in a book I was reading. A book, um, when they talked about, um, I guess his name was Servak. He was a servant of the dead three, and I think he's one of the dead three. So, interesting, okay. I'm not one's, uh, I'm not, I'm no one's offering except for when it comes to a starring. 
um, investigation. Get your bearings. What I mean, so what have you stumbled into? Uh, stumbled on? Arcana, try to determine who or what they're talking to. Looks like it's a red cap bard. <laughs> you are listening to a falsehood. He is not your real god. Honestly, Arcana or this would probably be the best thing to do. I'm curious, should I do it? Should I do the should I do the bard? I think the bard is more funny. So, you are listening to a falsehood. He is not your real god. So he said that all like booming. So let's go for it. Let's see. Ooh, I can Oh, look. See, yeah, you can add guidance and you can only you can either do one or the other. You can't do more than one guidance, but it's just funny that I have this. Oh my glob. Oh, and I got a 12. Okay, so we're good. So it's because they believe he's a god. That's why it manifests. And it said they used to be slaves of the mind flayers. Interesting. This world is so fascinating. But let's continue. Not real. No. You sense a flicker of doubt. Brief, but enough. For an instant, the godly presence falters. No. No. <laughs> Persuasion. Oh, he is a, uh, a f he is a fabrication. Whatever you create, whatever you've created him for, you don't need him. That's right. Strength. Let. Oh no. Look at me. If you want. Oh, if there's any god of death here, it's me. I love it. Intelligence. Seriously, Buhal, whatever this thing is, he doesn't even feed <laughs> He doesn't even feed you good uh good lies, bard performance. I am Buhal, Lord of Murder, Viscount of Violence. This one lies. Forgive me, I'm gonna read over that in post. I know I'm totally messing this up. <laughs> Viscount Viscount of Violence, this one's lies. Okay, so this is what we're gonna go for. Oh my glob, I hope I pass this. <gasps> Natural 20. When the bard speaks, everyone listens. I love it. Burn them! Shut it! Shut your rotten mouth! You feel the presence waver. One moment a god of awesome power, the next a common red cap. Yep. Ah, uh, bollocks! Don't do anything hasty now. The fish folk got plenty of power. We can share. Blessed boar! What? I'm Shut it. it, you! I'm talking to my chosen. Chosen got power. You want power, don't you? Mm. What kind of power? I'll just kill you and claim it for myself. Please. Well, bow low, Buhal's chosen. <laughs> bow before Buhal's chosen. I don't need your power or theirs. Um, let's see. I won't let you enslave them any longer. Bar performance. Uh, liar, destroy the pretender. Pretend God, my chosen. Hmm. I'm gonna do this one because I think this might be funny. So, liar, destroy the pretend God, my chosen. Oh my God. Oh my God, this is getting harder and harder. Oh no. I'm afraid to look. Oh, I got a 15. Is that enough? Oh, it's more than enough. It's more than enough. I like how I'm doing this. Oh my God. Hmm. What's happening? No, no, no! I'm the Lord of Murder! Me! <laughs> Oh, 
Wait, what? Oh no. Oh, so it looks like the fishmen are our allies. And the only enemy is the uh is the uh is the guy in the back. I love it so much. Wait. Do I have advantage? <gasps> I do have advantage. Let's get him, Asarian. Damn. Nice work, Astarian. Okay, can I do anything else? I'm gonna get Astarian into a better position, and that's gonna be right there. No choice but to keep going. Okay, so this water is electrified, so I am going to move Clementis back here. I knew that was gonna happen. I'm like, damn it, damn you. Take that. Really? Wild magic? Okay. Sorry, everybody. What else can I do with Clementis? Um, who's next? It's gonna be Gale. So I'm gonna bardically inspire Gale. Oh my glob, why? So you got temporary hit points. This is insane. Go ahead, send a Nice. So he distracted him. Oh, wow. Gale, let's, oh, I don't think we can do whole person on him. That sucks that we can't do whole person. Okay, let's do this. Oh, but I'll, I'll hit them. I don't wanna hit them. Well, let's make sure we do a shore hit. This is gonna be a shore fire attack. And I would trap us, which is really annoying. Help us little fish people. Ah. <laughs> it's so funny we have all these allies against this pretender. Okay, Shadowheart, she can't move either. Really? Hold on, let's see. Um, um, let me see if I can do this. Even though I'm at, oh, you know what? Make sure this is a for sure hit. Even though I'm immobilized, but still. Ah, of course. Now the little fish people will get him. <laughs> or they'll miss constantly. Good, he's bleeding now. Oh, wow. That part, okay. So my concentration is broken, which is, I'm referring to Clementis. Okay, can we get another advantage shot? Ah, uh, no. Can't do another, but let's see if we can hamstring him. Nice work. I will okay. give in. That's right. Okay. So now I'm gonna do bone chill if I can to ensure we got him. can't do anything else. Wow. These little guys are just dying. Okay. Gail. Oh, this might hurt the other little guys, even though I'm trying to get him. Yeah, see, I don't want to hurt them because of him. Okay. So we're going to do another magic missile, level two. Really? He just got a little life left. Get him, fishies. Nice. <gasps> I inspired a uh, Carl. I'm uh, Carl. Like Shadowheart. Okay. Okay. Oh. I think that was their leader. What are we doing? Praise Maclumba. Praise Maclumba. We can loot him? Oh, we can just loot him. Oh, oh wow. So I wonder, can we talk to him? I'm assuming that's me. Oh, thank you. I will take all your shit. Oh, this person was a sacrifice? Oh, wow. 
Can we just pick up everything over here? There is no answer from the presence. Ah, uh, no answer. That is hilarious. I wonder... I wonder how he got... How he ended up being their... Their deity. How did he trick them? Oh, we already got that. Oh my god, this is hilarious. I didn't know what to expect um, other than just... I'll take that. Yeah, I'll take that. Um, I didn't know what to expect. I was just like, let's see what's going on. But this is hilarious. But luckily, I was able to uh, convince them that he wasn't a god. <laughs> and they just gave me a name. So I wonder, do I get some kind of extra perk? Because... Well, let's not do that. Rotten fish. No rotten fish. Already got him. Already got him. And what's this? Oh, that's just to turn that on. Okay. Also, they don't even care that I'm looting. That is hilarious. Let's just pick up all this stuff. Might as well. Nice. It's not even stealing. I am so taking everything. Thank you, little fish people. Yes, love your God. Let's see if he says the same thing. McClumpa. Okay. I'm not going to question it. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Starion approves. Oh, my glob. This is hilarious. I was not expecting this outcome. Okay, so let's see what else we can find in this area. Ooh, more of these mushrooms. Okay, that. Yes, let's pick that up. I don't know why the camera's doing that. And I saw that it looks like there was more area uh, around here. Oh, all these potion ingredients. Yes. Oh my goodness. Yes, yes, yes to it all. Oh, this was so worth it. Besides, I wouldn't want to kill these little guys anyway. They're just like, you know, they're just celebrating their, what they believe is their God. So it would, I don't think Clementus would even want to fight them anyway. You know, cause they're like, oh, what's that? Rewarded for my, um, for helping these little guys. I love it. So this area is so worth going to. Oh, rope. Okay. So anything else over here we can use? Doesn't look like there's anything else over there. Except for those explosive mushrooms over there. Hold on, let's see. What is over here? Oh, a chest. Okay. So there's a chest over here. Okay. So it looks like there is a reason to come over here. Hold on, let's see what else is here. Okay, across, oh, there's stuff down here. Okay, looks like there's stuff over here. Okay, so I guess it is worth a, um, a search to like find everything in this area. Oh, cool beans. I'm very glad I did this thing. Okay, so before we go over there, you know, let's do this right. Now, can I jump over here? Oh, I can. Okay, Clementis, I'm gonna separate you from the party. Can I jump? Target is too far. Hold on. Let me see if I can get him right there. It's just, it's too far. Okay. So this is why, like I said, I'm going to switch to Carlac and everyone else um, to do this. So hold on. I think, hold on real quick. Let me get rid of this mushroom right here so I don't end up <laughs> sending someone over there to their detriment. Oh, look at that. Is that like a magical thing? Wait, can I shoot this as well from this angle? Oh, my path is interrupted. 
No, I can't. I can't. Okay. I think, I say I think Gail, hold on. I think because I gave Gail all my um, scrolls. Yes, there is a scroll of flying in here. And might as well, ooh. And this one right here, Dimension Door. But I'd rather use the flying for right now because Clementis, this is a spell Clementis can actually learn. On yourself. Nice. So, fly over here, like so, like that. Watch how you go. There's a trap. I had a feeling. And if you don't disarm this. Oh. <laughs> you know what I should have done? Hold on. Let me see if I can go back really quickly. Shadowheart. What's next? Please cast guidance on your friend. Okay. Can't give up now. There we go. Okay. Even though I probably should have had a Starion do this, but I think we'll be okay with the team. We're more than okay. Now, after I do that, then I have to unlock this bad boy and try to quickly hurry over and fly back. Open. Nice. Love it, okay. Cause I didn't know if I was gonna have to, um, Oh, perfect timing, because that's right when flight uh, wore off. Come on, boys. I'm talking to them like they're dogs. Come on, boys. I'm just kidding now. Okay, so now let's see real quick. Let's open this up. Oh, I still have to lockpick it. <laughs> right tool will do the trick. Right, the right tool will do the trick. Good thing I had all that on me because, wow. Okay, open. Oh, cool beans. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna give this and this and this and all of these to Shadowheart. Again, cause she's strong enough to carry it. Okay, so that was fun. But I'm glad, I'm certainly glad I didn't go over there while those, all those bombs were over there because you saw what happened when the one went off. Okay, and it looks like there was stuff down here as well. So we got everything. It's just so sad. Their little bodies are just laid out. Okay. Yeah, it looked like there was stuff over here. What's this? Fish? Horse. And camp supplies, yes. Look, Shadowheart, fish. It's not Baldur's Gate. That might be worth a look. Oh, a bottle. Let's pick it up. And also, this. Dad, sorry I stopped writing. We ran out of paper on the road. I uh, I got this from the Druids. Maybe they, maybe that's why they were so mad at us. Wow, because he took some paper. I hope we can find you. Zevlor says you got lost and the old house is gone. That you got lost and the old house is gone? But I read a but I read a book that says all rivers from that area from that way into the sticks. Into the sticks. Okay, hold on. I read a book that says all rivers find their way to the sticks that find a way into the sticks when you get it you can read me, uh write me back in Baldur's gate or maybe come visit i'll write again when i can when i can get some more paper don donnie the little silent boy that doesn't speak interesting i hope we do find his dad pick up yeah Oh, we do find his dad. That'll be so cool. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything else over here. We got this. Oh, we're gonna pick up this rope. You know, rope is always good. 
Oh well, I guess so. What else is over here? More rope. Clementis is looking at a starion and saying, you want to play a rope game? Ooh, something over there. What's that? Nice. Okay, let's pick this up. I'm so glad I came this way first. You know, cause it's like all this stuff is over here. Okay, open, yes. Ooh, all this stuff is worth it. And then there's light right here. Read? Oh. Once Ball's favor quickens within one of his beloved murderers, the bliss of his love is nigh indescribable. For he blesses his loyal with the new sensation, a mindless, instinctual, primal sensation that comes from within the bowels, an erotic spasm that washes over the killer in the moment of murder. It is said in that instant, his divine essence can be tasted. Forsake all other hedonisms, acolytes, for nothing else can compare. Until the true ecstasies of murder wash over you, initiates, this scroll contains a prayer you may say after a kill, calling for the Lord's disgrace to find its course in your body. Wow. That is very disturbing. Saying that they get like a... <gasps> Wait. This area is full of gold? Are you serious? Yes, we're picking up every piece of gold here. Like, what? Do people make wishes down here? Like, all this wasted money? I am, again, I'm so glad I came here first. Like, oh my god. Okay. And we got camp supplies. Yas. Okay. That looks like that's everything. Anything else over here? How about out here? No? Nope, nothing else, nothing else. Oh, that is so cool. Can we jump up here? Not enough space? Oh, I guess we can't jump that way. Oh, that is so cool though. Nice. Well worth the little side trip. Like, well worth it. Okay, so we go back up this way. So I don't think there's anything else here. They're just gonna be in their worship and devotion. Nice. Wait, is there anything over here that I should be aware of? Nope, okay. So I don't think there's anything else here that we can use. So it's time to go back to the surface of the Underdark, if that makes any sense. Okay. So here we go. Yikes. I did not mean to do that. These camera angles sometimes are wild. Target is too far. Okay, cool beans. All of them jumped over. Oh, a Starian. A Starian just wants close. He just wants attention. Okay. Lovely. Okay, cool beans. Now that that's done. I've got a long road ahead. We're gonna quick save really quickly. Now, again, for these mushrooms right here. Yeah. Oh. Okay. And he said he threw his backpack. Ah, this is his backpack. Nice. Okay. So that was his backpack. Now, I'm curious. Can I jump up here? Hmm. Oh, I can. Alright. I'm cur- Yes, we'll take. Too high. Too high. Fudge. Okay. So yeah, I'm gonna need Carlac and Lazelle to do this, apparently. Well, we're not trying to hurt you, Clemis, Clementis. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go to camp and switch out the party. I'm curious, do I need to do a long rest? 
my level two spells are gone. A long way from Waterdeep. Let's get on with it. She's still pretty good. Careful, I buy it. And he's still pretty good. Okay, so I think what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get rid of Gale and a Starian. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get rid of Gale and a Starian and put Lazelle and Carlac in. Do I also want to get rid of Shadowheart? I think I'm gonna do a party change. I'm gonna do a party change, and I, I say I will be back. Okay, guys, I'm back. So. I switched out my party. I'm bringing back Will, and I put Will in the Minthara armor because I think it looks better on him than a Starian. And I changed the color to a light blue, which I think looks amazing on him. So now Defender we're gonna level people. him up. Yes, we're gonna level him up, and then we're gonna head back to um, the next section uh, that I want to actually go to. Okay. So we get a new cantrip. Ooh, counter spell. I am giving him this now. And then new feet. Signs of ill omen. Agonizing blast. Oh, okay. So what I'm gonna do is give him this, the repelling, the repelling blast that he had before. So these are the things, and then also armor of shadows. See, so you can cast Mage Armor, and it won't, um, yeah, without it expending uh, a spell slot. So I'm gonna keep this. I'm gonna keep him like this because I like this. And then out. Uh, actually, I need everything here. Um, right now, I think what would I gain? Hmm. There's some pretty good stuff he would gain, but right now, I I think. The way he is right now, he's fine. So let's see. <gasps> Ooh, and I can cast lightning? Yes. Oh wait, this is called lightning. Okay. So after the lightning strikes uh, range with, within range, then after 10 turns, you can call down lightning again. Ah. It expends one spell slot, and you need to do it after a long rest. Oh, I like this. All right. Okay, well, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good about you, bruh. All right. At least things have stayed interesting. They have. They have. Mm -hmm. Lazel, do you believe in love at first sight? I hardly believe in love at all. Uh oh but I do believe in carnal pleasure. Oh. See, like, this is why, even though in my heart, I wouldn't mind romancing either, any of these three characters, but you know what I discovered? Um, when you go to the character sheet, and I will get, I will get moving. Um, oh, enough waiting, I crave blood. I know, she's medium, Carlac Attention. is high. And he Where am I needed? is exceptional. I love it so much. Never a dull moment. No, it's never a dull moment. I believe I quick saved. Okay, so now what we need to do is that we need to do this jumping thing. And I believe the only two who are capable of doing it. Action, not reaction. Exactly. Oh, wait, let me do something that really quick. Blood. No, never mind. Because she does not have light. Yeah, and then she also has dark vision, but Lazel does not. She failed something. So I'm assuming this may be a fake mushroom. Hopefully it's not. What's this? Oh, that one's fake. Um, I'm gonna assume this one is, that one's fake right there. So I'm gonna have her jump here. 
Oh, Lazell, are you okay? Best to watch my step. Oh, so now we know how Homeboy died. Let's quick save again. Yikes. And I'll heal her after that. Oh, and speaking of which, I gotta give her a potion. Beautiful. The underdog is everything I thought it'd be. And I. Right? This environment seems worthy of a Githyanki warrior's estimation. Oh, to be right? deemed worthy by the great Lizelle of Fresh Kalea. Continue <laughs> as you have, Karlak, and you will achieve the same. I love their conversation with, between one another. Okay. So it looks like she's the only one that could come up. Soldier. So, yeah. I believe these are the... Oh! She just started walking. Okay. Thanks a lot, Lazelle. She just brings everybody up. Go, girl. <laughs> Oh. Still alive, so that's progress. Okay. So use. Wait, am I back down at the bottom? Oh, I am. Okay, okay, okay. I get it now. We failed something. And then I saw this right here don't look like we can get that so that seems like that's out of our reach what did we fail oh wait what's this use pick up okay okay mushroom circle bones skull skull and a We'll take them. Okay. But is there anything else here? Another illusion? Is anything real down here? Right? Oh, I just did that. Cool beans. Okay.